five years and still talking, this is GabNet, the great American broadcast network. Talk like you've never heard it before. How are you? Welcome it's to the Ramble. It's Friday. Da, 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 da. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're, I took off today. You're, well, then it's not a big deal that it's Friday. It was a big deal to take off, and it was nice. Uh, really? Yeah. Okay, I wonder why you're a little... Yeah. Yeah, we're not hearing you as well as we should. But oh, well, yeah, that's, that's not me. It's okay. That's, that's right. you. But anyway, there's a two-shot now of us, because uh, uh, that's the, the way it is now. You know, I actually, I hate, I love your sign that you got me, but if I turn it off, it makes the picture look better. <laughs> I know. I've got to figure out what to do with that. There's no dimmer for that because those are LEDs. All right, but put it on for no, now. But, no, but, no, but it, <laughs> it doesn't make the picture look as good. Put it on no, for now and you can turn I it can't. off when I go to bed. No, I can't. I can't. Look, watch <laughs> what happens. Watch what happens. See what it does to it's the... It's just the background. No, no. It, uh, it really... It, it looks... Our picture looks much better without... It. I've got to do something about it. I'll figure something out. That was a gift. It was a I, stocking it, stuffer. If I can move it all the way over. See, when it was over there and then it was back there, it was in a it was slightly different... When was it over there? I don't know. I'm going to change Sign that lamp and I'm going to get more light in here. And I had to lower the light back there you because... You could get a second light. Huh? You could get two of these. In here. No, I'm going to take the one I got in the other room, which is brighter. Oh. And I'm going to put it there and take that one and put it in the other room. Okay. All right. But I'll do that over the weekend. Hi, everybody. How are you? That's that's my wife. <laughs> you know, I still can't get used to this missing tooth. Well, that's just the way life tumbles. <laughs> just this big gap that my tooth keeps falling into, and, and your trying to your tongue keeps going. Trying there. to commit suicide. Your tongue keeps sort. going there. Yeah. I see you have your new bucket, trash can. Trash can. It's called the trash can. Trash can. Yeah, I, I, I'd show it to you, but uh, I can uh, see it. Yeah, well, you can see it. They can't. Look at this. You have one, two, three, four, five. Well, this one I don't and need. And a little tiny one over there. No, that, that's the same. That's actually more like this one. This one's the second best one and you have one just like it over there never use it no but and this one i don't even use i don't even know why it's there so you know but we and then we have two up there see because i need two cameras here's why i need you know why i need two cameras no would please you, tell me Alex. Would you like an explanation yes, why I, I need two cameras because i can't operate one camera for two things in other words when i tell skype hey i want uh, a camera and then I want the same camera to be this camera, the one that you know that we that we use uh, when we're talking to the people, we're doing the main part of the show. Uh, they won't both work at the same time, ah. uh, so I have to have one, this one over here for Skype, so the people on Skype can see me, and this one for the audience. Ah, how nice! See, and the same thing is true here. That's why there are two of them there, and th that one isn't on. Uh, and then over there, you just get one because you're on your machine. So, and you never use it anyway. But I use it to test this. So, anyway, well, last night the uh, the new the new uh, the you know I I call it my my old machine, but it's really the new machine. The trash can. Huh? The trash can is the new machine, actually. Okay. So uh, anyway, so the new machine is is the is the trash can, but I kept saying it was the old machine because it was the one that went out to be fixed. And boy, did we get a new deal. New and updated. It, uh, it actually is almost like a new, absolutely new computer. They replaced almost everything. Did you out. write to that company that you bought it from? I'm going to write them should. and I'm going to say, look, I bought, I bought it on eBay and the thing went bad. And uh, what it was was a graphics board that went bad, but there were a few other little problems they saw. 
So they said, I wouldn't have to pay more than replacing that, that card. No, you they, don't have to tell them No, that I'm going to tell them. I'm going to tell them. And then I sent it down to Texas, and they replaced almost three quarters of the machine. I so would just say, obviously, the machine you sold me was pretty much ready to blow up on I me. wouldn't tell them the price. I would just say, this is oh, what Oh, no, I'm going to tell them replaced. so they know. So they know. Uh, but I, I want them to know that they replaced almost everything. And I'm not expecting them to, you know, to give me money back on it or anything like that. Hell, as it turned out, I turned out having a, a great deal have it happening here, you know? Mm -hmm. So uh, anyway, so, um, uh, you know, I'm in good shape. I got the trots again today. Mm -hmm. I've been having the trots a lot lately. <sighs> my, my IBS has come back. You want to talk about that on with the radio? A, yeah, sure. It's, uh, this, On the I, podcast? I, 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 have, I have IBS. If I ever have a TV network, I'm going to call it IBS. <laughs> it's 10 10. Hmm. Are you going to start doing that now? I'm just saying. I looked at the Are you going to start doing that? But anyway, actually 10, last night, because of the machine being fixed, the show just ran flawlessly. Great. And look, it, you see here, this is what it says, CPU. That's the usage of the central processing unit. I don't have my glasses on. And it is only at 8%. It's just a blur. By now, it would be up to about 25 on the, uh, other, on the, the, on the other machine. So uh, th this thing is just purring away nicely. I, mean, I knock on wood. But I do have a 90-day uh, warranty on it, you know, on the, on the work. So... so Anyway, so um, what do we decide? I'm gonna I'm gonna get an implant, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I told this story the other day. I had to have the tooth removed, uh, which I've been holding on to for the longest time. I felt sorry to see it go because it was such a trooper, you know. But it lasted and lasted, and it finally got infected. And they said, "Best you get rid of it, right?" And they so we got rid of it. So now I. I there's these things called, uh, they, they call them, I found out, it's called a clipper. Not a flipper, a, a clipper. clipper. And what it is, it's a little tooth that goes on and grabs between the two other teeth and holds a false, kind of a false denture in there. And it's meant as kind of a temporary measure. You're repeating of yourself. But you anyway, told us all this. But anyway, uh, I, I said, I, I really don't want an implant because... God knows, you know, I should get an implant, go through all of that, the $4,000, the, uh, the how many months does it take, six months, because to it takes one thing to heal, another thing to heal, put the thing in, okay, and mm -hmm. that the day after I get the uh, uh, implant finished, I either get run over by a car or I die of something exactly. horrible. I get a stroke, Okay. <laughs> You know, it's kind and, of like me with my long-term care. And so I, I didn't want an implant. It was, it's just too much trouble. But if I get the clipper, well, the, the new dentist I went to said they don't do clippers. They're it, dangerous. They, they, well, you could swallow them. You could. Uh, they. The, they one, have nothing one, to hold one, one to. other dentist told me, well, you, the tooth next to it is losing a little gum, and that could like exacerbate the situation. So then I said, okay, well, then what, what are the options? And she says, a bridge. And I go, uh, okay, well, a bridge is when you have like... Uh, two real it, teeth. It, you, well, you have two, uh, three teeth. Two of them are crowns, and one of them is a fake tooth that does the gap. And if you have two good teeth, they'll just grind them down and put the crowns on there, right? But if you don't, uh, like I have a crown on one side, but I have an implant on the other, and she said... Well, we can't do that then because you've got an implant um, uh, on that side, and we can't remove that crown, so we can't make a bridge there. I said, so what choice do I have? She says, oh, the only choice you've got is an implant so or just this big massive gap in your mouth, and I just, I don't like it, you know. But I'm going to have this gap in my mouth. What are you I'm doing? Just cleaning your teeth. But don't, no, I need those. Oh. Those are for this. Yeah, but you have them no, on there. I know, but I lose them. Oh, so it's your backup? Oh, boy. You know, she, she comes in here to do this show with me, and then all she does is try and clean the place up. Well, that's in my nature. It, it, oh, yeah, sure, <laughs> sure. 
You know, she always says, oh, your side of the bed's a mess with your clothes on the floor. Have you looked at your side of the bed? I don't put clothes on the floor. Have you looked at your side of the bed? I don't put clothes on the floor. Have you looked at your side of the bed? What? I don't do it. I, she, I, just, she just told me, fuck you. Yeah, this is well, what I get. I have, fuck you. The only way I get you to shut up. What? It's the only way I can get you to shut up. What? Say fuck you? Yes. Is that any nice <laughs> thing to say about the man you <laughs> ostensibly love? What man? Oh. <laughs> so. Okay. So anyway. So anyway. Back so, to your tooth. Yeah, no. So, uh, you know, so I guess I'm going to have to get the. I guess so. The implant. Mm-hmm. Which, you know, it's funny. The implant cost me almost as much as it cost Apple to fix this machine. <laughs> Maybe I could stick that in my mouth. Would that make a good implant? It would shut you up. Mm. What I was going to do with that thing, if they couldn't fix it... Send it back. No, I was going to keep it, and I was going to put dirt in it and plant something I would send it, it back. It was, if so, Apple couldn't do it, I would just send it back. Why? They wouldn't. The, the place on eBay wouldn't take it back. Didn't you have a... 60 days or 90 days? No, no? 30 days. Oh. And then I could buy. They had they had this plan uh, where they would uh, fix it for you. If Send it, it to Apple. If it, if it broke. And that, was, that cost 250 bucks. But you had to send it back to them in California by the cheapest way possible. So, I mean, at least with this. Did they pay for the shipping? Who? The company in California. Oh, yeah, uh, to get it here. Yeah. No, no, to send it back for repair. Oh, oh no, the the Apple store sent not it to the Apple Texas. Store. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the original. If you send it back to the people well, with the if, event. if I had taken their their warranty, you would have had to pay I would for have the ha- shipping. Yeah, I would have had to pay for the shipping to send it to them. That was my question. And then they would send it back, and they would do it at the lowest possible speed that you can think of. Whereas Apple and just change the one thing. Apple overnighted this to Texas. And they said they pick up their overnights every two hours. <laughs> so it, 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 it being in Texas is like it. They should put a, send it across town. Yeah, you know, so yeah. pretty good. Good. Anyway, so I had stomach cramps this oh, morning, and okay. I've got the trots again. Mm. I'm falling apart. We all are. At Listen, stage. last night I had a little problem, and I really feel guilty about it, folks. Um, I forgot Patrick's name. <laughs> Well, that's good. You're getting old. No, it's I. Every night I, this week, I've been taking Xanax to put me to sleep because I'm just I have all kinds of worries. Uh, let's not go into that, please. Would you like my list no, of worries? No, we'll do it at ten thirty when I go to bed. My list of worries. I don't worries? want to hear it. Oh, okay. I hear it all the time. Well, I shouldn't stuff. worry about it because some of these are your problem too. Oh, well, they ain't my problem, and I don't want to talk about it. Because you don't want to deal with problems. I deal with it, but Alex, you don't stop. It's nonstop talking about it. Give me a fucking break. No. Really, it's not funny. If you loved me, you would know how to handle. Well, you're me. really pushing it. When you're, hand- <laughs> you're when really- you would know how to handle me in these situations. Well, you're not a dog. You're not a puppy. Huh? Put a leash on you. No, I am like a puppy, and what you have to do is go, good boy, good boy, good boy. Yeah. Oh, good boy. Yeah. Everything's gonna be okay. Shut the Every- fuck up. I don't want to hear everything's it. Everything's gonna be fine. That's all you have to say, Alex, but you refuse to say it because you constantly talk because about it. Because you don't believe everything's gonna be That's okay. That's not true. Just shut up already. Jesus, I'm going to bed. Uh, no, why? What? I'm going to bed. Why? Because well, it's not want, time yet. I don't want to hear your complaints. Oh, okay. Well, uh, talk about Trump. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, you were watching a thing on medicine when I was. Uh, well, because it was, she, it was she why, watched tel- she watches television endlessly. It's why um, America has a very high death rate, and you know a death rate from what though? They, suicides, uh, pills, um, just just this constant stress in America, and mm-hmm. all the plants that have gone down, and people that have. So we have gone. more people who die in America. Per capita than yeah. anywhere else in the yeah. world. Yeah. Well, uh, in a developed country. In a yeah. developed country, yeah. yeah. Uh, and and uh, they uh, attribute this to what? Stress. Major stress. See? Non nonstop stress. You know what it is? It's stress that people feel that is not taken care of by the person they live with when they try and ask them if everything's going to be all right. Oh, please help me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't handle this. 
Anyway, <laughs> so because last night Phil was saying, "Oh, we, we you know we're the healthiest country in the world." Oh yeah, and Phil, right? We're not. We're not. As a matter of fact, I believe don't the Scandinavian countries have the best everything. The best I've Isn't seen. there a high suicide rate, though, in those countries? No, not no? at all. No? Okay. I thought there was because... Oh, they give them maternity leave, they pay for their college, they give them, you know, 19,000 days off of vacation. Um, I mean, it's, it's, it's civilized. I, I, what, I, what I don't get is the attitude that they seem to have about, uh, about uh, like, when Phil gets in on the snit about you know, health care and about Medicare and so on, which he's going to love when he gets it in about a year or so. Uh, but Medicare, uh, oops, was that my stomach? I don't know. Uh, making a noise. Anyway, um, he was he was talking about, you know, how the medicines, you know, medical system, you know, socialism, it's terrible. And I'm thinking to myself, if we don't take care of each other, then how? What the what, fuck are we what, doing who, here? Uh, what are we as yeah. a country? Okay, you know, what what does that make us? It makes us assholes, is what it does. I mean, they were just showing cities of dying populations and 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 just cities that have gone to rot, and you know, nothing being done about it, and the stress level of these people around the country, you know. Well, I uh, you know I feel sorry for old people because I'm old, one of them, and uh, I you know. The, uh, the the way in which we treat old people, like I was saying that our government actually is trying to kill me. You know, they'd like to take away Medicare. Oh, absolutely. And Social Security. And Social Security. And Medicaid. Uh, and they'd like to take away all these things that and benefit food, older and food, people. And food stamp. Benefit people. And do you know something? The, the quality and the morality of a country is how good they take care of their old people. And their population in general. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, more kids are going home to live with their parents because they can't afford to go out and, and make it on their own. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's horrible. What happens if I have to go to the bathroom? You during, go to the bathroom. The show. Put Phil on. Well, yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, I, ha I have a new way now because we get people, we get so people are full screen. Oh, I hate that. Well, I hate it. And I'll tell you it? why because you don't see everybody. Like, there was a moment the other night that I missed because you were concentrating on one person. Well, I wasn't. The well, machine whatever. does it automatically. Yeah, I didn't like it. I don't like the full screen. I like it because I, I can then go take a shit if I want yeah, to. Yeah, but you leave it on it. one person for too long, and it, it, it ruins it, really. The no, nicest no, it, thing is seeing everybody. It's, it wouldn't be too long if, if Phil would shut the fuck up. It's like sitting in a round See, table. See, show it, everybody, it, it, Because Alex. it's 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 keyed by, well, people write me about whether you like that or not, Okay. Uh, because Whether it's, who likes it's it or keyed not. by if somebody's talking, right? Then their picture starts showing. Then if somebody else talks, their picture shows. Now if Phil keeps talking and talking and talking, it's not the point. The point is yeah. it's a group. Otherwise, it could be just one person calling. Well, I mean, I, I go back to the group. Yeah, very rarely now, and I don't like it. Yeah. Mm. Oh boy. Oh. Ten twenty-three. What are you going to do for the next? Seven minutes. Go to sleep. You're going to go to sleep? <laughs> I feel like I have to pee now. So I, go. I go. just went. I went before I went on the air. I'm, I'm, uh, He's looking for his next yeah, ailment, you know, everybody. He's looking. The tooth came out. Now we're doing the next ailment. Is it going to be the prostate cancer? Is it going to be his stomach? Is it going to be the fact that he can't sleep and he has to take a pill? What's it going to be? This is the lack of caring I get from her. <laughs> Just complete lack of caring. It's 24-7, non-stop. Uh, dear, I just went to the doctor. Yeah, and what did he say? He said, I have a week to live. She says, okay, listen, I went to get my nails done today. He says you have a touch of the cancer. <laughs> well, I may have a touch of the cancer, yeah. That may be, that may well be. Who said that, Little Richard? Little Richard said that to me. <laughs> that as an excuse on why he couldn't show up is because he uh, he had a touch of the cancer. <laughs> I love that. I That's love great. that. Uh, and, uh, I don't know what he died of eventually, but I don't think it was cancer. cancer. Why don't you turn on the, the, gotta, the, the, the whatever? No. Why? Why? 
cause. I'd like to see everybody before I go to sleep. Well, it's you still got five minutes. Well, but five minutes I could see them and then go to sleep. And, 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 oh, wait a minute. I don't want that. That's not what I wanted. I hit the wrong thing. Excuse me, folks. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Let me get rid of that. Queen Seagate dashboard. There's one thing that looks a lot like the Skype. Mm -hmm. It's that thing there. So, you know. Do not make your icons. Call uh, in, folks. Well, I haven't opened up the well, lines yet. Please do it. No. I want to go to sleep. No. What? You, you, you want to go to sleep? Go to sleep. Okay. Right. Are you leaving? Well, because you won't let me say hello to anybody. All right. Let me see if they they may not they may not even be listening. They're yet. listening. They're waiting. Okay. Well, I'll make our our Skype line active. Okay. So the Skype line is now active. I got a call from Irv or thing from Irv last night text i can't turn off my skype so i went on here and turned it off <laughs> this morning he calls me he says i can't, I can't turn, turn it, it on. on and i said before you ever call me do me a favor reboot your machine it's he says true. i always forget he that says, too. okay i'll reboot the machine if i have a problem i'll call you i haven't heard from him all day no but it's so. true i forget to do that too Hmm? Like I was having the problem with my phone where I couldn't yeah. hear. Just, you know, one thing to remember, folks, is you Re reboot. Oh, Yay. okay. Oh, what do you know? Charlene Martinez is oh, calling. Charlene. And she's gonna, Hi, Charlene. She, Hi. She, she, she's going to be the first one here. The first Let me caller. see here. <laughs> Let me see if she's uh, there. There okay, she is. Okay, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Oh, there's Charlene. There's Charlene. Here, come, here comes here, Jeff. Here comes oh, oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. My TV's on. Sorry. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah. oh boy. And now uh, and she's sideways and she's sorry. upside she down. She has to turn her television off. Huh? I forgot. I got so excited because I've never gotten to say um, hi to you, Marjorie, live. Hi. Hi. Oh, and there's Charlie. What wait happened minute. to hold, Jeff? Hold on a second. I can't. I don't know what happened to Jeff. But uh, here, Jeff, here, call here, back. here comes Charlie. And uh, I think, uh, uh, let me see here. We got Charlie. I got to give him a little thing here, first of all. Oh, uh, come on. Uh, are you there, Charlie? Charlie's gone too. There's Jeff. Wait a minute. No, no. Give me a call when you're back. What, what? does that mean? Let I me see here. Well, wait a minute. Are you there, Charlie? No. We've, we're having some trouble tonight. Okay, There's here Phil comes Meyer. Phil Meyer. Let me see here. Is Phil Meyer missed call? What the hell? What is the problem? Oh, boy. We're having trouble with Skype. Tonight. Well, at least I got to say hello to Charlene. How you doing? Yeah. Oh, I got wet in the rain today. I'm a little frizzy. When was it raining? Um, I don't know. It's like misty or something. It's oh. weird. Is bad it like hair, bad hair day? Yeah. yeah. Very cold. Yeah. Yeah. Going to be the same way tomorrow. Yeah, and rain all till Monday or something. Uh, Bill, I've uh, got bronchitis. Charlie Wallace <laughs> is calling again, and it says Charlie Wallace missed Miss call. call. All right, guys. Uh -oh. I'm going to go to sleep. Okay. Mm, I'll let you figure your IT okay. stuff out. Uh, well, this isn't figuring my IT Night, stuff Charlie. out. I Good night, girlfriend. I, I, I don't know what the problem is with. Uh, with uh, Skype tonight, uh, this uh, this should work, and it's not working. Uh, let me hang Think up. Think of Maya, maybe the uh, Mexican gods or something. Let me let me hang something. let me hang up on you, okay? All right. And then I'll I'll have people call again. Okay. Well, wait a minute. Hold on a second. Let me try Charlie again. No, Charles Wallace missed call. Uh, I'll, uh, I'm going to close down Skype and start it over again, okay? Like reboot? Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to give it a, a, a try here. Let's see what happens here with Skype. Uh, da, 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 da. This, it should work. It should work, but it doesn't. Okay, folks, you can try, uh, let's see, you can try calling me, and let's see what happens here. Um, hmm. uh, Jeff Stein, give me a call when you're back. What? Okay, here comes Phil Meyer. Okay, there, hey. is, there is Phil. Okay, so I put Phil uh, in uh, where source one. 
Uh, scuba diver. Okay, now let's see what happens when somebody else calls. Um, did, did you have to kick off? I, I got a signal that said uh, my thing was too weak, and then uh, uh, I got kicked off when I tried calling earlier. I don't know. Your mic is awfully loud, though. Uh, uh, let, let me see what happens when somebody else calls. Here comes Charles Wallace. Let's see. Uh, no, it says Charles Wallace missed call. Oh, boy. Is um, that better? I turned off the cooler. Yeah, but it said it missed call from Charlie Wallace. Let me yeah. see here. Let me call. Uh, oh, boy. Um, well, Charlene, try calling us. Let's see what we get from you. Um, hmm. Um, here we go. Now, here comes Jeff Stein. And it goes, missed call, Jeff Stein. We can't hmm. How get, come I got through? I, I, because you were the first one calling. Uh, you want me to hang up and see hold, if it... Hold on a second. Let me call Charlie. Hold on. All right. Okay. Add to call, Charlie. Okay. Well, here comes Charlene Martinez. Let's see what happens with her. She had the same problem. Oh, there she is. There uh -huh. we go with Charlene. Okay. Let me put her in... Uh, uh, let me see here. Where is it? Number two... Uh, Charlene, um, let me see here. Um, there she goes. Okay. All right. All right. There we go. There's Charlene. Now There's we go Charlie. Jeff Stein. Let's see here what happens with Jeff. Jeff Stein missed call. Did you see Charlie's, uh, there's Charlie. Okay. Hello, Charlie. Can you hear me? Charlie, can you hear me? You're supposedly through. Charlie, are you there? There, there, there we go. There's Charlie. I'm here now. There's Charlie. I don't know what the problem is tonight. Let me also go up here to, uh, uh, let me see here. Where is this? this Charlie, thing? what are you, Baba Ramdas? Hmm? Uh, I'm here now. Be here now. <laughs> Be here now. Yeah, let me see here. Let me see what happens if I call. There was a where did I go? Charlie's frozen, I think. Charlie, are you there? Oh, Charlie's frozen. Oh boy. Oh, Skype, you motherfucking cocksucker. <coughs> well, uh, I have no idea why this isn't this isn't working. Did you do the Skype update on the uh, Mac yesterday? What I didn't. There was no update. Oh, I got a thing that said there was an update. There was no up update. I'm going to add uh, um, Jeff. I'm calling Jeff. Let's see what happens if he gets added. And let me see here. Add. Um, okay. There, there, there is um, finally. Uh, and uh, here comes Tony Magno. Let's see what mm -hmm. happens to Tony. I get the same problem. Tony Magno missed call. How is that? What is going wrong with, with Skype? Um, hmm. Let me see here. Let me do a plus on Tony Magno. Add. Uh, let me do a. And there's uh, there's Jeff. And um, I don't know where whatever happened to, to Charlie Wallace. I have no idea. But hold on a second. Uh, for uh, Tony Magno. Uh, Tony Quisp, okay. Uh, well, we're slowly, <laughs> right we're, we're, we're slowly getting people on tonight. Uh, but uh, uh, we still don't have Charles Wallace. Uh, so let me try calling Charlie. Let's see here. Charles Wallace. There we go. There we go. Let me call him and add him. Let's see what happens. Uh, if we if we get him at all, um, you know, I, do I have to put up with this? I just you know. Mm -hmm. Tonight. Want to start it again? Uh, uh, no, tonight is just Skype deciding to fuck up. Yeah. We had this problem late last night too, you know. Um, well, uh, let's see. Calling Charlie Charles Wallace, but. Uh, uh, I think uh, Rob Alfano, now watch, it'll say if I have, 
There, Rob Alfano missed call, so now I got to call Rob back. All right, Rob Alfano, add. All right. Uh, here, I, I know what I can do. Uh, let me see here. Are you there, Rob? <coughs> Rob? Rob, are you there? Well, I, I just called Rob. Did you call me? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. And then I got, yeah, to make it work, yeah. Yeah, let me see here. Let me because I call. couldn't get it. Rob Alfano, add. Okay, now it should be ringing Rob Alfano, and uh, we'll see if we get Rob added to this. This is just this is this is a clusterfuck. What is what is the problem with uh, with Skype tonight? You know, if it isn't one thing, it's another. You know, and this uh, this shouldn't be happening with Skype, uh, and there's something wrong with it. Uh, are you there, Rob? By any chance? I'm calling Rob. I'm calling him. Uh, let me see here. Calling Rob Alfano. Calling Rob Alfano. Calling Charlie Wallace. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, uh, calling Rob and Charlie. And uh, I don't know if either of them are going to answer. Uh, this is such a clusterfuck. Uh, I am. A, a, I am uh, who, who's that? Who do I have? Who, who's there? Charlie? Anybody? No. Oh, well, I have no idea why this is happening. At the Stein household, they keep taking their clothes off on the I air. I was thinking of like <laughs> jokes, right? It's like a toga party. We're not going to look around. Well, you see, <laughs> Rob Alfa. Okay, Rob. He's going to be run on cheats in the Rob, house. I'm going to call you back now. Okay? I and think Pam just closed the door. <laughs> Smart. Sorry, Phil. <laughs> like Jeff is going to be Spartacus. Rob? See, that's what I get for not coming on one night. Okay. That's right. Okay. I'm. I just got Rob. Oh boy, this is. Are this... you having trouble, guys, tonight? Yep. It, okay. it, it, yeah, Skype took a while to log just to pop, pop up for me. I had. A, it was weird because it was telling me your connection is too weak. Me too. So I rebooted. I figured, me too. Okay, maybe you know, and it's the same problem. That's really weird. I yeah. Um, yeah um, I um, um, I've got a strong signal here. You know, um, I have no I idea maybe, what the problem. Maybe Skype's internal systems are screwed up tonight. Oh, you use the same one. clipper I do. Well, yeah, I had that problem the last night with um, with Bree, but it was because he was using his iPad. You know, yeah. uh, so I don't know. I have no idea what this is about. See, Rob. Yeah, it's the perfect cutter. It's a little different. Oh no, so my mind. Mine doesn't have the uh, opening. It's uh, it's flat. Rob, you're not vaping that thing, are you? Vaping? I don't vape. Because the other night when I was on, like when you were like inhaling, it kind of looked like the vape thing at the end. But it's a real there's cigar, no vaping. Right? Yeah, there's no inhaling either. So, so you got a thing saying that your your signal was too weak. Is that yeah? Me too. Upon, upon the hang up. Like and then it it gave me an option to send a message. It opened up a little white little message box that said your connection was too weak, and then it said send a message. Uh, I guess I could have sent a message to Gabnet because that's who I was calling. It could be a know. problem. It could be a problem with Skype. I believe uh, that is. It sounds like it's a Skype issue. Yeah. Yeah. I um I got the same message. So what I did was I uh, shut the Skype down. I opened it back up. I closed my laptop. I closed my phone. Uh, thinking that maybe I had too many things on the network, and uh, because yeah. we haven't changed anything here, I mean none of my preferences have changed. Let me take a look here. Any of my preferences <laughs> changed? The audio, video? No, it's fine. Mm. Calling? Uh, for, no, no, no. Caller ID, messaging, notifications, contacts, general. Um, no. That's no. when I thought you were vaping, Rob, when it was, yeah. you were doing that. No, nope, we're fine. We're fine. Anyway. I, I, hey, yeah. Rob, old school. Zippo. Zippo. <laughs> well, the next time somebody calls, I will just... Um, <laughs> if, if one more person calls, I'm going to hit the plus here and then click on them, and that should answer it okay. But, mm -hmm. 
Uh, it's been a it's been a a rough busy week, so this is very enjoyable. Get to ooh. hang out with some friends and chat, enjoy a good cigar and a good scotch. Yeah, yeah, cool. And and then then <laughs> then Phil starts acting up, and you'll want more drinks. <laughs> Scotch. <laughs> it don't matter that he, he acts up. He's still a good friend. Yeah. Thank yeah. You. Yes. It's all in fun. It, it's, it's not fun. I think know, he's crazy, but he's still a good friend. He is actually. <laughs> I'm starting to buy into it a little. <laughs> that's the con. Well, that's because you're an idiot, Tony. <laughs> right. Slightly. You're a fucking moron. <laughs> he's starting but to sound like Bill. Moron. He don't have to worry about making a payroll, you know. He's he's home. He's taking care of Phil, his mom. He's got well, no worries. This, Phil, wouldn't it be yeah. nice if you, as an employer, <laughs> didn't have to worry apart. about providing <laughs> medical <laughs> benefits for the people who at work for you? I don't. I just tell them the beatings will stop when their attitude improves. <laughs> well, I mean, it shouldn't be employer's <laughs> responsibility to make sure you have medical coverage. Everybody that works for me is on Medicare. <laughs> <laughs> You don't need two legs. It must be One fun when they're on their knees. Somebody else. Oh, no, not the installer. If you're out yeah. there, somebody else call the program because I want to give it a try here. But I think I can. Uh, I can. You want me to message Charlie for you, Alex? In Facebook? The Charlie? You want me to message him for you to call you? The Charlie who? Wallace. Charlie. Oh, Wallace. Oh, yeah, Charlie. I'll Facebook him and I'll message him in Facebook for you. Tell him, I can tell, tell him to call. Tell him to call the show. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you'll have to go to the other screen. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. But, um, you know, Rob, my grandfather used to call his cigar a stogie. Stogie, <laughs> stick, we call him, you know, a, a good <laughs> stick. Is any a lot of terms? Is it for Cuban them. or something? Or nah, those Cubans are overrated and and okay. Okay. here You're here comes tight. Kevin. Now let me do something here. Hold on a yeah. second. Let me try something here. Uh, Kevin, I'm going to try and get you to no. You see, he gets the same problem. But if I go here, I, I can uh, uh, I can do Charlie. I can ring on Charlie and add him, and then. Patrick, now watch with Patrick. Watch what will happen with Patrick. Um, there we go. M missed another call. Okay. I oh, wait, a minute, I wait a minute. Wait a minute. There but Patrick is. is there. And uh, let me see here. Hold on a second. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta start adding these people. Hold on. Uh, bu 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 here is Patrick. Let's see. That would be Darth Pat. Where is he? Uh, Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Oh, there we are. Darth Pat. Okay. Okay, on that. And then, uh, let's see. Scott Boddicker, I'm going to try and have him answer. Uh, he, he just got fucked over, but he came on. Hmm. Isn't that strange? That's very, very strange. Hold on a second. Let me go put Scott Boddicker in here. Uh, <laughs> Scott Boddicker, okay. Yeah. Sorry if I blew the smoke in your face there, Charlie. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay, here we go. Smoke of vision. <laughs> there we go. There we go, folks. Um, um, yeah, I, you know, this is very strange. Um, what happened here uh, that was very interesting uh, is I was able to answer those phones, and they did come on here. Hello, Scott. How are you this evening? You called. I I called. So yeah, yeah. So you said you would need another phone call. So I'm fine. Yeah. Well, good. Yeah. Uh, stay there. We like having you here. So any, well, anyway, busy. I don't I don't know what's happening. It's something with Skype because it it did say missed call, but then Scott was on. It said missed call and Patrick was on. So all the times before that it went bad. These times now all we need is Charlie. Charlie, where are you? Yeah. Well, he's frozen. I see him. Uh, he's there, but we need him back again. Otherwise, he will stay frozen all night. Charlie, Charlie will give you a full house. No, no, he won't, because no, he's already so there. Cute. If oh, you I may see. notice, but he's frozen. So oh. anyway, Charlie, try and give us a call if you can. Anyway, uh, where was I? Um, oh. Hmm. A anything happened today? Oh, in the new. Oh yeah, the um, uh, the job figures oh. came oh. out. They were very good. Uh, yeah, 
And uh, not as good, though, as they were under Obama. Not as good as they were under Nixon, you mean? I mean no, no. Not as good as they were under Obama in the amount of increase in jobs. The largest, the largest amount of job increase, employment increase, happened under Obama. Don't go no, Phil. That's a fact. No, you're just deluding yourselves. You're doing. You're finding anything oh. you can find, any Phil, statistic. Phil, I'm telling just, you, just so I am that you don't have you. to admit that Phil, Trump's doing Phil, a good job. The the job growth that we've been having has happened over the last, uh, 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 what was it? Something like thirty months or something like that. The largest single oh. amount of job growth that happened during this job spurt that's been happening happened under Obama. Less has happened under Trump, but it's continued under Trump. But let... What do you mean? Don't give me a jerk-off. Go look at the statistics, Phil. I am. It's it's right here. He added 263,000 jobs this 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 month, and it was uh, uh, it was uh, jobs in Phil, the sector Phil, that I'm in. Phil, uh, well, it's what? in private... Privately owned businesses. Oh, good. Oh, you that's know, Obama wonderful. Obama added jobs. They were shovel ready. They were government jobs. They they put people on the government dole. That's where he added Phil, jobs. Phil, where Trump is when you're jobs, talking about he's job increases jobs to the to the people that are actually creating oh, jobs. You just you don't listen to anything. No, you don't listen. You you, you know. Wait a minute. Yeah, please. You're, you're just. Don't be you're just a, don't, another Trumper. Don't don't answer my question with what I just called I just, you. I think that that's. Unfair. Well, life's not fair. <laughs> Tell me about it. Mm. <laughs> and you called in for this, huh, Scott? <laughs> <laughs> no, he called well, in because he just, wanted to drink. I just had mute button on when Phil was talking. It's 50 times what did you say? Uh, what did you say, Scott? <laughs> when I see Phil's picture come uh, full screen when I'm watching, yeah. I just put the mute button on. <laughs> <laughs> you just put the hey, mute button on. Scott, just take a drink. <laughs> I'm not drinking tonight. I was hungover from Wednesday. What did you get? What, did you, what were you drinking on Wednesday for? I wasn't it, here Wednesday because it was Wednesday. Well, I, I was prepared for Phil to be there, but he wasn't there. So, <laughs> but I was already drinking. So, what the hell? No. Oh, okay. Did you call Wednesday? By the way, I think you did, didn't you? I did not. I did not. I, I waited not. for Jack. Oh, oh Patrick's you, got his hand up. Yeah. Yes, Patrick. Uh, two things. Yeah. Uh, Tony got his glamour shots. Uh, Filter on his camera again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, wipe yeah. away the Tony, webs. Tony, <laughs> would you clean your lens yeah. again? I don't know what oh, goes on in there. It's, it's Vaseline. It's soft. Does, <laughs> does somebody... Really wait a minute. My, 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 oh, yeah. Oh, spit. That's what we need. Spit. Now it's fine. <laughs> All right. Now, now the other thing is I wanted to just... Uh, That's uh, enough, Tony. I was lit last night... Mm -hmm. And a comment about my legs were probably moving too. Yeah. <laughs> laughing fit. That was perfect, Rob. That, you, you were pretty damn close on that. <laughs> that was really funny. I was watching you. I thought you were reacting to what was being said, and you were getting so animated. Oh, I was glad I was there for a gabnet moment. <laughs> yeah, well, well, the people who were watching Skype uh, saw... What, what I've now referred to as Miss May. Uh, 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 That's going to be Miss 219. Huh? 2019. 2019. She gets the whole year. She gets the whole year, yeah. Uh, uh, it, was, uh, it, was a, it was a moment, wasn't it? Yes. So well, that was kind of cool. Um, uh uh, I, I, you know, I don't know what to, uh, uh, what to, what to say exactly, you know. But uh, uh, we uh, have to apologize uh, to you, uh, Jeff. For well, it's not our fault. We didn't do it. You did it. Uh, <laughs> uh, she was a good sport about it, though. Yeah, you're you're muted, Jeff. Cool. I just want to know if she kicked your ass after you got off. When she, You're still, oh, muted, still muted. No, what you did is you told me he was muted and he wasn't muted. No. Uh, there we've he been goes. having some good uh, discussions about it. It's kind of fun. Yeah. I have a call up some of uh, some of our friends and I said, Guess what happened the other night? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Where, where's Charlie? I thought Charlie would call back. Um, Pam did leave me a nice uh, little note off of uh, Jeff's account. So, um, yeah, I, I appreciated that. But I, I would have done that for anybody. So Yeah, well, you, it was like you were going, I thought you were a crab or something. Like could you do? Could you recreate that for us just for a second? <laughs> just so people can see what you were doing? <laughs> that's <right. laughs> yeah, that's it. That that's was it. kind of flailing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I I knew I'd never be able to get my voice in there because everybody was going at each other, and I thought, well, shit, maybe somebody will see me that's flailing right. like this, Patrick, like that. <laughs> you were going crazy. Mm -hmm. um, uh, let's see here. I. Uh, uh, Charlie called, but then he had a problem. So let me now try to add him. Here we go. I'm adding you, Charlie. So now call again or answer the call I'm making to you, okay? And that should probably bring you in, all right? Uh, yes, they think, here we go, here we go. Uh, he's I think he's answering. Yeah, I see him. You see him? I see his, pi I see his picture. Yeah, this video yeah. There, there we are. Goes. Okay, I don't, I don't know what the problem is tonight, Charlie, but it's something with Skype. You know, it's it's something with Skype, and I, I, I have no. I had to re-download Skype. Hmm. I had to re-download Skype. Ah. Yeah, but no, but that didn't fix it. No. That didn't fix it. No, it didn't. No. So, I, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, after the show's over, I'll have to, um, you know. But it, I but I don't seem to be having any problems here, you know. So uh, uh, I, you know, I, I and I'm I'm online and I'm everything. So I I don't know what it is, you know. I don't think it's you. I think it's Skype. Oh wait a minute, we just lost. Oh, this Scott again. Uh, I think it is Skype. I, I'm hoping yeah. it's Skype. I don't want to have to put up with this every night trying to get people on. That It should be that simple to get people on. And uh, it started last night with, um, with Bree, but then he went to his personal computer, not his iPad, and it was fine. So uh, I, I, you know, but uh, did you get a thing, Charlie, that said uh, uh, you don't have enough power or something? Connection is weak. Did you get something like that? Are you gone again, Charlie? Charlie's, Charlie's yeah, gone frozen. again. Wow. Yeah, I was getting those two uh, last week or so, too. Connection is weak, and then it gives yep. you a chance to send a message. Oh, wait a yep. minute. Kevin's yeah. there. i got to put Kevin up here. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Uh, where are we? Uh, Kevin would be in the number nine place. Let me put, get Kevin. Kevin, you came through okay, didn't you? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, let me see here. Uh, bike is usually bike rider. There we go, hog rider. Okay, there we go. And uh, there we go. Boom, boom, boom. And you know what, 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 that, what that means, actually? Hold on a second. Uh, here it comes. Huh? Here it comes. Here, here what, here what yeah. comes? Here's what, I know here's, what gonna do. here's what comes. It's a You're full house. Full house. I knew it. <laughs> That's my other little that. trick I do. It's my full house trick. There we go. So, anyway. Uh, so, um, uh, let me see here. Okay, so we, I don't know. It, it's got to be something with Skype. Uh, and who knows what they're... Oh, there it is. Huh? Uh, I saw it now. The full house. Yeah. In fact, if you went if you went on the uh, if you went on the internet uh, and you uh, uh, check Skype, I bet people will be complaining about it right now already. You know. So. You but, mean on the YouTube? Y yeah. Uh, well, yeah, no, not on YouTube, but on if you if you just type in Skype problems. Oh, oh I, 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 I bet there are people that are already having this problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I thought you meant people complaining about the show. Something. Well, that, that, <laughs> I thought so too. Yeah. <laughs> that could happen. That could happen. Uh, anyway, anyway, where was I? Um, so we were talking about the the economy. 
Um, you know, you got to give Trump a little bit of credit for it. I, I'm not, I'm not dismissing that. But let's not forget other people who laid the groundwork for this recovery as well. You got to remember that Obama, when he took office, this economy was in shambles. Yeah. And he managed yeah. to turn it around, and he managed to get jobs going. And, but it was all and, George and, Bush that and, turned and, it and around. And, you know, the thing is that uh, Phil seems to have something against hardworking people because he keeps deriding <laughs> shovel-ready jobs. There were none. All he did was he created uh, jobs in the government. You what know, jobs and, did he create? This uh, little, uh, you know, low-paying government jobs, uh, all sorts of show, social work jobs, giving, a, giving, a, giving away more food stamps. Or, you oh, know. That, well, the, 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 so the job that he gave away was the guy to give away free food stamps. Is that right. the job he, he created? That's, that's one of them. That's, I, I remember that job. Yeah. Yeah, I wish I could Did get that apply? job. Yo, yeah, well, 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 you know, what, the jobs it? that uh, uh, well, Trump like, is... Well, wait a minute. What, what is so wrong about a job huh? like that, Phil? There's, there's nothing wrong with work, but what is positive about Trump's job creation is it's in the private sector. These are not more bigger government. So what jobs are they? Uh, 263,000 in uh, this... No, uh, 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 263,000 uh, what? Jobs in what the private sector. What kind of jobs? What do you mean? What kind of jobs? What well, you know, I mean, why, why, who are you calling a moron? I moron? call you a moron. If anybody's why? A moron. Why? <laughs> what do you mean? What kind of jobs? <laughs> well, are they jobs on the left hand side of the street or on the right hand side of the street? They're jobs. What? They're in the, they're the private, private sector. sector. How do you know they're private sector? They might because be. Because I just sector. read it. I just read it in the jobs report. Yeah. Why don't you read the jobs report? Then you'll see where they it's two hundred and sixty three thousand jobs. Yeah, but no, but uh, you read something and then it gets filtered through this brain that then decides what's what it is all about. And you're wrong. Yeah, well at least it doesn't get filtered, you know, through a Eugene Debs brain or a, a Bernie Sanders brain or any other of those other what, socialists. What's wrong with you Eugene V. Debs? Communist. <laughs> Was he? Well, he's a socialist. You know, he was a union oh. organizer. Oh, and that makes him a communist. Oh, union jobs aren't any good. No, yeah, but, it, but uh, well, do you union, remember the union, union, you remember jo union the jobs? At, union the jobs in San don't. Francisco? Union, no, union don't jobs remember. don't no. matter to Phil because they're shovel ready. You know, union it's not, it's not yeah. union yeah. jobs that don't matter. It's just government. All created right. jobs right. for the sake so, of creating more bureaucracy you're, is you're, what you're, matters. You're monopolizing what Trump the show. Did, all right. You, you're monopolizing. You know, I mean, I would just want everybody else to be able to say something if they feel like saying something. That's all. What did he... Uh, oh, he froze. I mean, so what happened, what happened to Charlie? God, Charlie. I didn't mean to... I, I wanted to mute him, but I didn't. I didn't do it, Alex. I swear I didn't do it. <laughs> you could mute him. <laughs> I, 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 I was hovering over him, and I was hovering, and I'm like, I, I muted, uh, you know, uh, so that I, it wouldn't pop up. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, okay. I, I, the only thing I can agree with Phil is, with Phil, I agree. My daughter is graduating college, and she already has two job offers, but they're not created yet. But they're actually going to create one for her at this place she just uh, applied to today. Or she flew to Dallas to interview on a job, so... Do you, do you know what they're saying about uh, job interviews uh, for uh, you know new hires? Is that uh, the the usually within two days of applying, if you don't hire, uh, they think that you don't you're not interested. They move on to somebody else and they get another job somewhere else. It's such a tight uh, hiring market. And she she interviewed that? today, and uh, by the, when she was flying back to Fayetteville, they they called her on the phone and offered her a job. So, that's 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 the way it is right now. That's yeah. the climate. Yeah. So she she did pick a good time to graduate college. Yeah. I don't think she's graduating no more. <laughs> so how come there are all these jobs and I don't have one? Mm -hmm. I don't want one. Um, <laughs> but buggy whips aren't being used much anymore. I see. Okay. <sighs> You know, uh, Sorry, you could yeah. have a job if you wanted to do something. You know that 
I, I mean, you also don't make any effort to find a job. That's part of the reason you don't have a job. What do you mean? Job. I made a lot, a large effort to find a job. Uh, in the last five years? Huh? The last five years? In the last five years? I, I've been, I, I oh. keep looking, but it's, a, it's futile, Phil, because nobody well, wants to hire anybody my age. That's all there is to I, it. I know in your business, there's definitely age discrimination. My yeah. friend, uh, uh, who's a PD, and now he's a consultant PD that uh, you know puts himself out to five or six different stations, uh, and doesn't get very much money for it. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, the, when he was in his fifties, he couldn't get a job uh, in radio, and he was like the top PD in Detroit for sixteen years in a row, and. Uh, couldn't they don't job? program so you know, that makes perfect sense right because unless you're doing talk radio all music radio today is uh you know past past uh, like 30 40 years old they don't program to you so if you're in your well, 50s and you're looking for a job programming a radio station you're not going to get it his 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 uh, star was in country western even still you know the, the madison avenue if they're still on madison avenue but they still use the term you know they that sweet spot demo is like 18 to 34 mm -hmm. and once you once you get over 50 years old they want nothing to do with you as an advertiser they don't program to you so why would anybody want to hire a pd that's in their 50s it's just that's just makes sense right you want yeah. young well, now ideas in, now you want young his, people now he's in his 60s he's two years older than me and uh you know he's he's working like a dog, making sure uh, his stations do their IDs at midnight and and all of those things. You know, uh, doesn't sound like a very interesting job. Well, no, he also programs the music. He programs any uh, contests. Uh, you know, all, all of that stuff. But all the automated and, stations and, that are right. And no, and and then he has to do what else? They do the the, um, the music log. So he he yeah, programs. It's... Into the computer, so the computer can just keep right. Next song, next song, next song. Yeah. yeah. But uh, yeah, it's it's hard at the you know at the age of fifty, he was you know he was making in the one eighties uh, back in the uh, in the um, in the late nineties, early two thousand, and uh, you know now it's twenty four thousand dollars a year if he's lucky. Well, so because he's got a that's a data a data entry job for the most part. Anybody can put music in a playlist. Well, he picks what music it's yeah, going to so be. That, right, but he has a program called Selector or one like that that automatically yeah. chooses the artist separation and all that. It's yeah, you know, I've it's, seen a screen. it's mindless yeah. work. Yeah. 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 But on the other hand, um uh, you know, um he's he's not working. Or he is working, but he's working for less than he used to. Make. I would do that, less. though. I would love to be. How old is he? 68. So I, I'm 62, and uh, I'm going to continue to milk the gravy train I'm on until as long as my company will have me. But for me to get comfortable in another position, uh, trying to learn another company's products and go out and try to sell as an engineer and, and be the guy that has to do all the talking, I don't want to have to ramp up again. So yeah. if I could get a job like that, making 25 grand a year where I'm, you know, doing something like that, I would love that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, but uh, yeah. I tell you, he's, he gets a lot, of, a lot of demand on him. Uh, he doesn't a lot of work. There's a, he's, yeah, he's it's a, lot, a lot, of lot of radio stations. There's a lot of unmanned radio stations out there that, you know, you know, need that kind of thing done. Th those stations run 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And that music list just keeps going and going and going. And they gotta, they gotta keep filling it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, but, it's, but the fact of the matter is I'm still, you know. I'm still not working. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. I mean, if you were to edit videos, uh, I mean, you, you have so many talents, uh, you know, beyond, I mean, you have a great talent with the interview, uh, but, uh, you know, what you're saying is that you're being discriminated age wise for that. And uh, that, that's too bad. I, I think mean, that because I haven't been using my talents. OK, yeah. uh, I think I'm 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 not as good as I was, you know, well, uh, but you you're know. a lot better than 99 percent of the rest of them out there. Well, I, you know, I, I mean, if even if you're not using your talents as much, uh, there aren't there are very few people that have your talent or, or that even profess to have it. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey Alex, there might be an opening at Sirius Radio again. Another position. What, what do you mean there might be an opening at Sirius r- Radio again? Well, Mark Thompson's been on hiatus for a couple of talking several weeks now. To ramp up again. What? So what? if I could Wait get a, a job Wait like that making twenty five grand, he's got there. Hold on, I know I do something like that. Hold on. Okay. What? Tell me about Mark Thompson. He he got in a in a shoving match at one of his. Uh, meet and greets or whatever, one of his rallies. Holy shit! Mm-hmm. And, and uh, he got uh, he got uh, on. I don't know if he's on probation right now or whatnot, but he hasn't been on in about two three weeks. I'd heard something about the fact that he might be he might have gotten fired or something. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He 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 has been around, and I don't know. There's a petition to get him back and and whatnot. But somebody got in his face, and he defended himself. Yeah. Well, what I, kind of it, show does he have? Evidently, uh, it's a black show. Match. He wouldn't like it. Uh, it. Oh, how do you know? Uh, is it, it music uh, or talk? I, I figured this much out already. Oh, uh, is it music it, or talk? It's talk. It's a talk, oh. it's, a t- it's a talk show. Yeah, Mark Thompson. Yeah. Um, Did you see the, the the headline tonight that North Korea test fired some projectiles? Good. Is shooting again? Yep. Yeah. No, no, yes. no, it's just uh, uh, Kim Jong-un blowing his <laughs> wad. Well, he didn't get his $2 million, so he's mad. Yeah, yeah. Well, today uh, t- uh, Trump had to, had to call Putin to make yeah, nice, get, nice. Get more instructions. Get more instructions from, <laughs> get more <laughs> get more instructions. Instructions from the yeah, boss. Yeah. What should I do next week? Yeah. It's what we got to do. Uh, yeah. I, I, I wonder... Do you what, think what, that maybe what, they what, were talking about Venezuela? What, Charlene? Um, no. I heard, was it yesterday, or did you already talk about it, that Trump is going to charge people to get asylum here? Like, did you hear that? Like, no, charge me to come in here to get away from... I got your before. asylum, 995. Fill out this app. It's not a crazy idea, really, Phil. Hey, they do it when you rent an apartment. Yeah, he's right here. You know. Like an immigration fee, like if you're... Guy, country, I like his ideas. You know. He's off the wall. <laughs> yeah. I mean, they already pay a lot of money as it is, right? Right. You got to put them on. To the coyote? Three hot meals in a room. Come on in. <laughs> yeah, it's Cinco de Mayo, so Trump must be celebrating, right? He loves, mm. you know... Is this the 5th of May? No, yep. it's the 3rd. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I thought it was because they were celebrating uh, where I was. Uh, tomorrow, Everybody tomorrow, in New uh, uh, tomorrow. The, uh, they're playing Spanish yeah. music really loud everywhere, and everyone's complaining. Uh, well, t- <laughs> tomorrow is. Uh, oh, wait a minute. No, that may was, the fourth be with you. Yeah, oh, Star Wars. Oh, yes, yeah, may the like fourth be with you. It is Star Wars Should Day. May the fourth be with you. It's, and also. It's with you. Post- Mike, today's my birthday. This is important. What? Today's my birthday. Uh, my Happy sister's birthday. birthday. Oh. It's not your birthday. I'm my birthday. Well, I thought it was your wife's birthday the other day because <laughs> she was in a birthday <laughs> suit. <laughs> Everybody's she was wearing her. She was wearing her birthday suit. Yeah. That's, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Tony used to work on your hair. Are you still selling hats? Oh, yeah. Is he still going to do the hats, Tony, right? Are they on the Gabnet store? Tony used to work at the hat uh, factory. Yeah, but hopefully I I get hired from the city soon, Rob. So then, thank God. I I ever consider that you're the mad hatter? Soon I will be. I want to be the ex hatter soon. <laughs> I can't wait to get out of there. There's mice running in the place. We had birds in the fucking warehouse because they had a nest. I said, why don't you get an exterminator? We don't need one. No, we'll just fall. They, one of the workers' jackets got shit on. I said, that's good luck, Tony. Well, they that's tell you good that's good luck. luck. Yeah. It's good luck. It's like a fucking movie. That's and, and they tell you it's good luck because you got your fucking jacket shit on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> tell the story. It's good, I said, good luck you because it was the other guy that got his jacket <laughs> shit on, not exactly. you. <laughs> My mother's like, don't you need anything in there? I said, I'm not. I can't, I leave there to eat. Eat. I don't even want to work in there. It's all. <laughs> <laughs> She's calling me on the phone. You see any birds? No. And you know what it is? She calls me on the Alexa, Alex, 
and she has the TV so loud. So she's like, I can't hear you. Well, lower the fucking TV. <laughs> she's talking over the TV. <laughs> and you call, call you back. Don't worry about it. There's no birds. Everything's you okay. Alexa to lower the TV? Is that how it works? I don't have an Alexa. Push it. The volume. It can. Yeah, it can. Your yeah, TV is TV show in the back. Judge Judy. Yeah. Um, Does she watch Jeopardy or anything like that? I'm out of this. That guy's a crazy man. If I see another top hat, I'll got Stage four. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's the cancer? Uh, the same thing that. Pancreatic uh, cancer. Life. Yeah, pancreatic cancer. Who? who? Yeah. Alex Trebek. Alex Trebek. Trebek, yeah. He's the Katie Couric of uh, pancreatic He's cancer. He's got stage four? Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. He says he'll be back. They they just wrapped the season, and he says he will be back. Have you been season. watching this guy? Yeah. Who's been playing the game? Uh, Alex, yeah. I watch him. He just answers right away. That guy's it's amazing. amazing. Well, he Thank to begin you. with, my my business manager has been a big fan for the longest time of uh, of, of Jeopardy. Uh, basically said that, uh, hold on a second, I just want to put my camera up there, uh, uh, said that his biggest, uh, his biggest ability is the way he's playing the game. What he's yeah. doing is he, first of all, uh, he has a, uh, a, a, a what do you call it, memory. Um, photographic. Photographic memory. That's, yeah. that's for starters. He uh, is a gambler. That's what he does as a profession, and he's playing it like a gambler. He takes the big chances, and he gets them. Like what they do, double jeopardy. You say, okay, forty thousand. You know, and today, today was a bad day for him. He walked away with eighty-two thousand yeah. dollars. Oh, wow! It's fucking amazing. It was a bad he day. Crazy. He's, a couple of he's, days. He's up to almost one one. He's uh, he's up to about one million, what, seven hundred thousand dollars or something like that. But he yeah. has to pay taxes, right? Like, oh yeah, clear No, that. no, it's tax free. It's all tax free. Does he's he public. does he get that money as he goes along? Because like oh, now, yeah. for example, yeah, yeah. for example, they're breaking for the for the next season, so he doesn't get any no, money until the, the next season. They're not breaking for the next season on the oh, air. I, 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 on the air, they're breaking yeah, for a okay. two week uh, teachers. Um, uh, a tournament, and then they will come back with him. So well, because uh, did you see the the, um, the 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 video thing that Alex Trebek came on and he thanked everybody for all the great cards that they're breaking for this season, but he plans on being back for next season. He's they're done taping, according to what I read. Well, no, yeah, but they, that whole that whole show was in the can because he announced that a while ago. Yeah. No, no, no. He just came out again. It was a second announcement. Yeah, but uh, some uh, that that particular group of shows has been in the can. That's all been taped. Oh, I thought I thought they were going to bring this guy back next season. No, he's coming well, back. He's coming he back in coming two. Back next season, he's coming this, back this, in. This, he's coming back in two weeks. Yeah. So, uh, oh, okay. but and now how long that will go for before they break for the for the season? Uh, I don't know, but. Yeah. Uh, I sure hope he keeps going long enough to beat Ken Jennings' record, which is 2.5 million, something like yeah, that. Yeah, he's yeah. still in what That's second or third deal. place. Yeah. Do you watch the show every night, Alex? Yeah. yeah, I'm watching it every night now. I, I, this is, this is, if if you've ever watched Jeopardy, what he's doing is unheard of. Yeah. Okay, I mean he's averaging seventy-five thousand dollars a night now. Ken Jennings, wow. who went. And, and made 2.5 million, which is the most anybody's ever made. He did that over something like 46. No, it was like 70, 72, 74 72 days. shows. This guy's sure. only on like his 23rd show or something like that, yeah. and he's already up to 1.7 million dollars. Yeah. yeah. So he's at where Ken Jennings averaged about 35,000 a show. This guy is averaging somewhere around seventy-five, eighty thousand a show. Yeah, easily, it's crazy. Yeah, it's they just really can't crazy. Can't stop him. The other uh, contestants. Hmm. The other contestants can't beat him. No, no, they can't even get yeah. an answer in. They're no. close they to him. They can't yeah, bring yeah, in. Yeah. What I would do is, if I were them, I would just say, uh, "Okay, I'll sit here and try and answer a few questions. Just let him, let him win, rap, get his hundred. I, I think I saw him go over a hundred thousand the other night. Oh yeah. Yeah. His his high game's one hundred and thirty one thousand. Is it really? Yeah. Oh, oh boy. 
amazing. Uh, you may you may have found another profession there, Alex. Before Alex Trebek dies, get on the show. Yeah, actually, on this show that I watched of him with Alex Trebek tonight, he didn't look that well. He really? Kind of. Oh. He kind of. If you see him walking out, he's kind of. Yeah, because he's on chemo. He's doing yes, chemo he and doing the show at the same time. So you know, I knew a guy doing that, and he used to go to the gym too, work really? and get the chemo. Really, he's been cancer free on and off. You know, how old is he though to go to the gym? I know, I, I know he's older than me, so he's got to be in his seventies uh, or something. Because Alex Trebek is, he's up there. He, yeah, Alex Trebek is like seventy-eight or so. I looked it yeah. up. Yeah. yeah, he's he's up there pretty. Or he cool. might even be older than Alex, or our Alex. <laughs> do, do people live that long? <laughs> watch he's it, watch it, Scott. Watch he's, it. He's freaking old, man. <laughs> it's How old? Like that now, now that he's announced it, right? Like you know, I want to tune in too and keep watching him to see, like, is he gonna look good? Is it you know he's gonna. I tell you, my dad had my dad had that man, and he lost so much weight. Wow! Yeah, my, my dad had it too, Rob. He couldn't eat for the last sixteen days. What did yeah, what, 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 to that what, point? What, my father what, lived what, about two years, and and uh, he did, the biggest thing the doctors kept saying is you got to try to manage your weight, manage your weight. You got to eat, 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 eat. But when you got pancreatic cancer, you don't want to eat, eat, eat. Yeah, that's what he is said. That he what it's going to take for me to lose weight? Yeah, there you go. Hey. What, 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 what did your, what did your father have, Tony? Pancreas. Oh, okay. He had the same thing, Alex. Pancreatic. Yeah, pancreatic we didn't know it until the You're end. Getting really wild. Yeah, we didn't know it till the end. What a coinky thing. Till the thing. end, he didn't know it. Yeah, wow. they didn't know it to the last month. That's the way. Alex to back. Yeah. That's the best, the best way. Yeah, I mean, it was. He died at home, and so he came to peace. But that was hard. That was one of the hardest things I had to do because at the end, I, I, that just I, happened, I was right? hoping he would pass away because it was hard seeing somebody like that. That just yeah. happened to you, right? I remember yeah. now. Yeah. I was like, please, enough already. Yeah, it makes you question things. I'll tell you that. Yeah, my father had cancer. He died at fifty-five. He was oh, a smoker, and it was you really know hard to watch him, like you know, just waste away and. Then he was unconscious. It was horrible. I was talking to the doctor, Rob. He said it pancreatic cancer is very high in smokers. Was your dad a smoker? He was. He had quit in his mid sixties, but okay. he smoked when he was, you know, yeah, a teenager. Like that. He quit for about twenty years, but he says it's very high in smokers. He said, "Yeah." I mean, for what it's worth, I don't know if it means anything. Yeah. But I guess it does. Hey, that's funny. I guess Alex, when usually, you know, years ago, I don't want to say young, did they ever know the effects of smoking early on at all? Or no? Um, yeah, they did. did they they know, did, but they ignored it. They did then? I mean, it's a shame. Because I remember they had a fight to put that sticker on it, right? But what? There's a whole movie about that. What's the name of it? Yeah, that was with the, the inside. What was it? With Pacino, I remember. in. Are we are we talking to? I don't hear Phil and I don't hear Alex. Yeah, you, right. you, Alex don't, you don't hear me. Hear there you go. Now oh. I hear you, but if Phil's not. We don't hear. Oh, I muted. There you go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah, yeah. I didn't want the screen to jump up. Yeah. Th thanks, Rob. Thanks, Rob. <laughs> 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 my my friend screwed it up uh, for everybody. Pancreatic what? cancer, but he didn't smoke at all. Well, oh, wow. hey. Was, well, uh, it, 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 uh, it, 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 it can be, it, who knows what causes these things, okay? That's what, 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 what was it, Superman's wife's name, the, the Christopher oh, Reeves? Oh, Barbara Kidder. No, 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 no. no, no that was the, in the, the movies, the, Tony. His, his real wife. Oh, she oh, died of oh, lung yeah, cancer, yeah, never smoked died, a day right? in her life. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, yeah. Oh, but, uh, but I knew a guy who died of... Uh, Pancreatic cancer. <clears throat> Bill Hicks, comedian, oh, yeah. died at the oh, age yeah. of um, of um, uh, what? Thirty two of, pan <clears throat> of yeah. pancreatic cancer. And uh, but he was a drinker and a smoker. And they say drinking and smoking can have horrible effects on pancreatic cancer. But for somebody to get it at thirty two. Sure. Was what what, what? 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 Let's see here. There's uh, there, say say something, Rob, so we can see your picture. Uh, oh shit! Uh, <laughs> Drinking yeah. and smoking. Yeah, yeah, but that's yeah, well. Yeah. I'm scared for Rob. I don't inhale these. So, 
Well, I don't know. Like, for instance, uh, my, my ex-wife, Ronnie, got pancreatic cancer, and I, she wasn't a drinker that I remember particularly. Mm -hmm. She but was she a smoke, smoker. Right? She was a smoker. Yeah. 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 But uh, who knows? You know, it's a, it's, <coughs> it's a luck. Yeah. Of, it's a luck. It's, it's basically right. it's a luck of the draw, you know. Uh, right. And some people, some people get it, and some people don't get it, and who knows why, why, and why not? So I, I it's like you say, Alex, something's going to get me. Well, of course, Tony, something's going to get you. <laughs> I, just, I just hope it's not for a long time. God forbid, I'm going to get buried with my mother because we got a plot now. Well, oh. you got to get her buried first. You I know. know she even said that too. But let's. Not, I wanted to linger a little bit because I got to get paid. <laughs> Tony, where is it? Tony, <laughs> Tony, Tony, Tony what a loving, right? what a loving son you are. Nor I know, you are like, Norman you, Bates. Off, There's no question of me, my thinking. You're Norman Bates, for Christ's sake. <laughs> I, now, is your mom I, I listening to this show? Right? You know Tony, it, it, yeah, Tony, yeah. is your mom listening to this show through her Alexa? No. She heard Alex the other day mention orgy. I had to lower the volume. <laughs> <laughs> she, she was in the bathroom. What is that? Who's talking? I said, oh, God. She probably thought I was watching a dirty movie or something. What, what, do you, I'm on the fucking do you, computer. How, said. how do you listen? Let me give her her cream. i got to put her cream on. She's in it. How do you listen? Oh, how do you do listen to the show when we're talking to you? Do you have your speaker on? Is that how you do it? Yeah. yeah. I have my laptop on. She was RG, in the RG, yeah, RG, RG. No, I, RG. I got on the other side. I lowered you. Like, what is? What are you watching? RG, 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 RG. There goes. That's real Norman Bates wallpaper, there, folks. Look at that. It is. Yeah. <laughs> sure is. Oh man. Oh man. What? Let's see. What's he, what's he saying? What's he saying? What do you go for a glass of water? And look at those curtains. Those are Norman right, Bates' right. mother's yeah. curtains. I grandmother think. curtains. Huh? That house from Psycho, the grandmother right? curtains. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Has he got a switch plate that matches the uh, the wallpaper? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, I got a question <clears throat> for you because girlfriend, for instance, I've been doing a thing lately where I go to full screen on new people. Okay, <laughs> when when you're talking. And I don't know if any of you have looked at the program to see it, but uh, some people are saying they like it, and other people say they don't like it. Marjorie doesn't like it. She says she just likes to see all the people talking. I but, think you should control it so that you make it full screen when you want it to be full screen. Well, that's what I'm doing. Well, I, I, I do. Well, no, you're not. Hey, Alex. Alex. What? what? I, just, I just found something on my on my Skype. Mm -hmm. there, there's a new control on the Skype. That I can I can control the speaker view also. Uh, uh, if you got a Macintosh, yeah, really? yeah, we yeah we 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 talked about that a couple of weeks ago. Oh, did you? Yeah, you oh, can I'm... hang up on people, you can mute people, everything pretty much. Because okay. I was going to make that I was going to do that blur thing, but I I couldn't figure it. It's it's not there anymore, but uh, but I it's got a speaker view now. Well, oh. I wish they would do something. Oh. To make this uh, like tonight, it, it was fucking up. Now on next Tuesday, it might not fuck up like that again. But at least I was able to get everybody in, except for Charlie. Charlie, can having, I message him too? Yeah, well, if he if he would just try again, I, I have tried. I've gone up here to the plus, and I I've gone plus on Charlie Wallace, and I'm now calling him. Okay, so it's calling Charlie Wallace, but he's not answering. So, Did he have some bandwidth problems? I don't know, but I don't know what the problem has been tonight. But there. Oh, wait a minute! Uh, Rob just got the blur to work. Yeah. What? Where? where what, what was that? Uh, I, I turned, I've never been I able turned to on find the blur of the background. Yeah. Huh. Well, I can't blur the bl background on mine. I can't either. Reason. It's the three dots. If you look down at the bottom of the screen, oh, they moved it. The three dots. Yeah. More three options. dots. More options. And and it says start recording. Turn subtitles on. Turn there's subtitles. No subtitles. Hold. Yeah. Call. There's, no, there's no blur. There's no blur. Mine is blur. Blur my background. We can no, go. I, I don't have that. Really? What kind of computer are you using? Apple. Mac MacBook. Really? 
Yeah. That's funny because yeah. I hit I, Alex. I don't have that. Op- I don't have the blur either. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. I got yeah. the blur. Yeah. Oh yeah. I see go, the you blur. blurred it. I'm blurred. Wait a minute. Is, is uh, let's see here. Is is Tony blurred? Uh, yeah, Tony's blurred. No, that's his. Um, that's his camera. Yeah, that's that's, that's okay. Yeah, no, that's uh, a spider there, webs. There is no blur on mine. Uh, and mine either. I wonder why. Yeah, I just have start recording, turn subtitles on, turn off incoming video, uh, uh, hold call, uh, audio and video settings. Yeah. I got a blur. And, and but do you have those other ones there too? Yep. Yeah. And well, except there's no subtitles. I mean, there's I, no I subtitles. I was that. I turned them on because I wanted to see if all of a sudden I'd just see it transcribing. Yeah, but, yeah. I could uh, start recording, turn subtitles on, yeah. turn in, uh, off incoming video, hold call, and audio and video settings. And, and mute Phil. Mute I know. I, I wonder that's... if audio and video settings under that there that there'd be a blur. No, the blur is in between subtitles on and turn off incoming video. Yep. Okay. Yeah. No. Uh, when I went to audio and video settings, it just put up that screen. Oh. It allows you to see Whoops. see your camera. Yeah. The blur is also in that audio audio visual thing too, but it has a just another switch in there. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'll check that out. Yeah, yeah, yep, yeah. Yep. Right underneath the photo, but you won't have it, so it doesn't matter. Well, I don't know. Uh, mm-hmm. I, I didn't have it before. There's the photo. It says audio microphone uh, automatically adjust microphone settings. Uh, yeah. No, and, uh, there's, no, the photo, there's no blur. There's a, button, there's a button that says blur my background button. And, no, yeah. no, it's not. Not on mine. And it could be because Alex and I have the same uh, uh, camera. The, what is it, the 920 or the something? Brio, yeah. No, I have yeah, a using Skype 844040. No, no, no. We have uh, a, a Logitech uh, camera. I use. Oh, an, I, yeah, the, we're using the, the internal camera right. on our the cam- right. The camera. The camera f- I'm using for Skype is a 920. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and the camera that I'm using for Skype is the 920. The video. I the one I use for video, which is uh, uh, this one, is 4K. Oddly enough. Yeah, but it's an external oh. camera, so it's probably not allowing you. No, no, that the, one it, setting. Would, it would not be part of that. No. Yeah, it wouldn't be part of that. Anyway, doesn't matter. Hey, mine's in, mine's in uh, an hey, external Logitech camera, and it's working. Oh, you can blur. Yeah. yeah. Well, there you go. Maybe they're not compatible, and oh. the one that uh, the one you guys have is not compatible. Well, no, I, so. I don't care about the so. blurring. I care about the fact that you should be able to call me, and I should be able to put you on the panel. And yeah, that, that, <laughs> and, and every night that works. It's tonight. It's not. So it's just no. probably Skype. Yeah, yeah. It seemed like a Skype message anyway, more than anything else, like an, like a system message from Skype. You know, I'm the only one that got a Skype update message lately. No, I, no, I, I had to update. I haven't. Charlie? Hmm. Well, I, I have no idea. I, I'm, I'll try updating it when I'm through, but I don't <laughs> think that has anything to do with it. I think it was Monday or something I updated. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, oh! There you are, Charlie. How did you suddenly, suddenly you uh, you, you showed called up? me? I called. He's you. been here for I, a long time. I, oh, really? Yeah. He's been here for a long time. Hold on a second. Let me uh, let me see I'm here. Working. He would be in the ninth place. So let me let me Full go house get again. Charlie. Let me go get Charlie. Where are we here? Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Where I got a there? Charlie Wallace. There we go. Okay. And uh, I do that, and uh, I do that, and there's Charlie. Okay, and a full house. Yeah. Does anybody else have this weird problem with the circles, right? So, mm-hmm. because we have so many people online, the only people I see in circles are Charlie and Kevin and Scott. I don't see Charlene in a circle. It says plus two. Oh, well, what, what, what you do? What you screen? do is take your your mouse. Yeah, and you probably have it on the Skype canvas. Okay, take it off of it and click on your just your your screen. Oh, if I if I you know what happens if I don't because I have it full screen right. Mm-hmm. As soon as I move my mouse, they disappear. If I don't move my mouse, right. I see Charlene and hey, yeah, that's right. weird. But if if it, mm-hmm. here if I were to go on there, people will notice. Uh, 
I can get the plus two. Well, it's not coming up now. Hmm. Oh well. Uh, but it, but it sometimes I have a problem with it that way. So, but I I have all the circles of everybody. Uh, we have what yeah. eight people? We actually have nine people. And um, let me see here. I have one, two, three, four. I, what, where, where? Oh yeah, I have I have nine people. Yeah. Um, Plus so, yourself. Anyway, folks, You're see here we are talking about the technology again because it's been fucking us over tonight. And um, hey, what? today was my first day of the new diet, the keto Ooh. diet. How's that going? And I'm eating these prepared foods that they send me. They're they're freshly cooked, and you just reheat them. And uh, I had two today. They were delicious. And uh, is it enough I, food? Well, I had some cravings tonight, so I went to Whole Foods and I bought a dozen of these things, mm -hmm. uh, water, and, and uh, then I and I bought some olives and uh, and I and I ate half of them. <laughs> but uh, you know, <laughs> a lot of fat but, in olives. Well, fat is good in the keto diet. Oh, but, what is what is this keto thing? It's very similar to the Atkins. Uh, it's just that it's the uh, diet of of, uh, of the day uh, right now, and uh, right. and I'm supposed to be able to lose weight, keep my sugar down, and uh, uh, so far I, the food is delicious. I I, I was really surprised. I, plus, I don't like fish, and the first one I had was a salmon, a uh, 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 broiled salmon. It, w it was it was delicious. No what bones. What do they give nothing. you with it? What do they give uh, you? Uh, sides, like uh, there was a um, uh, cauliflower uh, that looked like a sweet potato and tasted like it. Uh, there, uh, there was string beans, oh, stuff like that. Wasted. It takes two and a half minutes to prepare it. And... Uh, it, with a microwave, and it was it was delicious. Uh, it's called Factor seventy five, mm. and uh, so every week they send me twelve meals for one hundred and thirty bucks. And you're bucks. the spokesperson, Phil, right? Well, uh, today I am, <laughs> but uh, like Oprah is for uh, Weight well, Watchers. Well, you know, I've done all of those things like um, uh, Nutrisystems. And Nutrisystems, after about three weeks, it tastes like cardboard. Oh, it's horrible. Oh. After a while, Nutrisystem, oh. everything oh. has the same taste. Right. Now, you were cardboard. on a diet. Well, hold on a second. You were on a diet, Rob. Uh, and what happened with that diet? I got off of it because uh, it's not something that you stay on forever. I lost 50 something pounds, 50, 50 odd pounds on it. And um, I m maintain that for I've I've, lo I, I've gained back a few now, but that so that I've been off the diet now. It'll be about almost a year. Okay, and, and how much did you gain back? About eighteen. Yeah. Uh, okay. Did well, you have any uh, health issues or anything? Uh, no, no. I got off of it because I just don't think it's a good thing to be on forever. Yeah. So I got off of it, and uh, now I'm looking for another way to try to, you know, maintain and stuff. But that's tough. Well, the the maintenance was working for a while, and then I screwed up, and now I, I'm having trouble, you know, maintaining. Uh, yeah, I'll uh, you know, I'll send you something that, that keto thing. Uh, the food was delicious. I have this uh, thing Phil, I bought. Phil, Phil, uh, Phil. You know, mm -hmm. essentially what I did was a keto diet. I mean, what right, it is yeah. is you're supposed to put your body in ketosis, which is... Uh, it's not I, happening for me. I am no, and it, it's not course. happening. I use the strips, and I... But but yeah. all I did is I, for breakfast, it was bacon and eggs. Right, And then for dinner, it was like a steak or some salmon or something like that. And I just stuck with that for like uh, uh, nine months, and I lost 60 pounds. It's easy to do when you're home a lot. When you're out all day, when you're and, out, you and, can do it you, too, Phil. I when I would eat at a restaurant, I knew exactly what I could order because right. it's simple. It's simple at a restaurant. But yeah. what happens is I'm driving down the street and there's a McDonald's and well, there's well, a well, nobody says you have to of, stop at the fucking McDonald's, you <laughs> fat no, fuck. It, it, it's an addictive thing. Uh, it you is know, addictive. You know, fast food's addictive. Yeah, and and you know I'm hungry. It's three thirty, four o'clock. I I haven't eaten lunch. Uh, you know, I said, okay, I'll go in, I'll grab one, but I eat two, <laughs> but at least I'm not taking it. Well, you know what, soda. Phil, I haven't had sugar 
for instance, I haven't had sugar in about two and a half years. Yeah. And and quite frankly, I never try sugar. And the reason I don't try sugar is because if I try sugar, uh, I will uh, probably wind up uh, being so addicted to sugar oh, so uh, that that you immediately start getting an addiction to it again. But right now, yeah. I don't. I can look at a, at the most wonderful fudge cake and not even want it. My you biggest know. my biggest weakness is ice cream. Yeah. Oh. So you know what I, I did? You know what yeah. I did? I I have one of those, uh, and this is terrible. But I, I have one of those uh, stand, those standing KitchenAid mixers. Yeah. And I bought the the ice cream attachment. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My God, I made butter pecan ice cream. Uh. That is just, I mean, it's sinful. You make the recipe, you you put it in the refrigerator, you take out that that bowl that they that you buy from KitchenAid, you put it on the end, and in 20 minutes you've got like soft serve ice cream. That is, and you put in fresh pecans. Oh my God! I mean, see, that's the, I have it in the closet. I won't that's even put it in the freezer. On, that's the way they make it on those food shows. On well, TV. that's what I thought. We get it, and then it's, it's also like I looked online. There's a bunch of keto recipes for like sorbets and things like that that you can that you can have. But the but I had to try it once with the butter pecan. Yeah. Wow. Oh my God! Well, I, talking it's, about ice cream. I was in Whole Foods tonight going to get the water, and I'm walking down the ice cream section, and I'm looking, and I'm seeing all these gourmet ice creams, and I had to just say to myself, push, push, just push the <laughs> cart, push the cart, get past this, push. But I listen, took one. I'll show you what happened. I mean, I, I lost about 55 pounds, 60 pounds. I think I put on about five pounds of that, okay? Mm -hmm. Because I, you. That's I, a long time yeah. ago. And I, and I did that about uh, two Thanksgivings ago. I started yeah, the diet, right. and look at me. Look, I'm still. Yeah. Look, you know. Uh, I mean, I I I I could take off another ten pounds. That's yeah. about it. You know. Enjoy life. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, but uh, you know. So I mean. But well, all I'm saying is, if you want to lose it, you can lose it. Yeah, but you've got to. You've got to quit. You never can say at any point during the dieting, hey, you know, I think maybe I just could have a piece of chocolate. You know no, what I do for I, chocolate? You lose a week. You, you lose a you, week. You know what I do? I use all the sugar. I sugar-free chocolates. Uh, I, I do sugar-free chocolate, sugar-free pudding as a little treat every, every day after dinner um, that has hardly any carbs in it at all. Uh, it does sometimes give me the trots because I have yeah. uh, IBS, you know. You know who's been very quiet tonight, uh, and uh, I, I, I really would like love to hear from him. We haven't heard from... Oh, Patrick, he's got his hand up. I, uh, he was the guy who wanted to say something. Yes, Patrick, go ahead. Um, well, I, don't, I don't know if, if you all know this, but I didn't drive for almost six months. Because I had a sore on my foot. Yeah, I remember. I was aware of the sore, but I was not able to drive um, on the advice of the doctor. I mean, if there was an emergency or something, I could. But they wanted me to keep pressure off of that heel and off of that sore. Mm -hmm. so because of that, I gained about five or six pounds, which mm. most of you would go, big fucking deal. You well, got to push it. It, it Well, the problem for me is Lifting. that five or six pounds Wait. is enough that I notice it. And the reason I gained it is not being able to transfer in and out of my car and breaking down the wheelchair and putting it in. Just that exercise was enough to keep me at my same weight that I've had since I've gotten paralyzed. And it's the first time that I've gained weight. And it's frustrating because I know I'll get it off in a, you know, in a, in a month or two once I'm back driving normally, which I'm able to now. But uh, that that's frustrating trying to get, you know, that. I, I, I don't want to be cruel uh, here. And it will be anyway. Yes, <laughs> no, I, 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 I don't want to be cruel, uh, 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 Patrick. But if um, I were in a wheelchair because I was paralyzed from 
the waist down. I think the last thing I would worry about is my weight. <laughs> but he, he doesn't have a, an electric wheelchair. He has to, he has to, he has to push it. And pushing that five pounds uh, could be a lot more work. Oh, well, well, get sword. Maybe, maybe you got an answer there. Yeah. yeah. What? The, the, the biggest problem that you have, if you're in a position like me, where you're completely paralyzed in the waist down, meaning you can't move your legs at all, right? You know, there are overweight people that use wheelchairs and things like that. Mm -hmm. but well, not use your legs at all, and you have a lot of weight around your midsection. Can't you wipe your ass. You're able to transfer onto a shower bench, onto your oh, bed, off of the bed, and the more weight that you have, the more pressure you're putting on your arms, and it just, it's a lot harder, and that's why I've always been against using motorized wheelchairs, because there are a lot, not not every, but if you look at people who are really paralyzed and not just overweight, um, if they're using a motorized chair, chances are they are overweight because mm -hmm. they don't have the ability to do a lot of physical things. And since yeah. I can, I not only worry about my weight health-wise, but it makes it a hell of a lot easier when I'm transferring my body weight because it's all dead weight. My arms are moving the rest of my body. Mm -hmm. And the bigger you are, the harder it is. So, uh, Once you hit 40, the metabolism slows down. It's harder to maintain your weight. Oh, yeah. So it's it, that 40 number is, is, is key. In, in you got to keep I don't know it's it, your metabolism just slows down. Yeah. What's the forty number? Forty years old. Forty years old. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, Jeff. You're muted. Oh, uh, you're muted, Jeff. You're I know muted. somebody who to develop a, a wheelchair attachment that gives people who are in a wheelchair. Uh, the ability to exercise while they're still sitting in the chair. Have you ever seen anything like that? No, I, I do all my... If, since, since you are a Facebook friend of mine, you can get um, into Wait, my... Hold on photo. a second. Hold on a second. Charlene, you, keep, you, keep, you keep moving that camera everywhere and it's driving me crazy. Okay. I know. I've got to. What do I get to put the phone in to keep it stable? A table and a book. <laughs> <laughs> a they, got, they got holders. They, they got holders. That, a little yeah. tripod. I'll, I'll try to look. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, anyway, anyway Jeff, Jeff, you can go on photo albums and you'll, uh, there's some videos I have here of me exercising. You'll see what I do. I run uh, in my chair and there's, there's different things that I do. Mm -hmm. And I lift weight. They're only three pound dumbbells, but it's the repetition and and it's just to maintain, you know, what I yeah. have. Let me let me ask uh, let me ask Kevin. Um, what about you? Do you uh, because you've been having some trouble with your back, uh, and, and and I would imagine that you don't get a lot of exercise because of that, right, Kevin? No, because it's, yeah, it's my legs. Yeah. Yeah. Same uh, thing. I just got cut loose by the doctor this this Wednesday. Mm -hmm. So she's telling me to find a pool and start working in the pool, and that's what I'm trying to do. But yeah. all my neighbors have moved away. The pools that I used to use, yeah. And the one pool in town here is like a cesspool. So I, I got to find something. <laughs> you know, the gym down here is not mm -hmm. the best. So but I got to uh, find something to do. And you know, I can't do impact because mm -hmm. that hurts. And it's hard on my my calcaneus that's separating from my foot. Mm -hmm. so I gotta find something. Is, so is your shocking thing working? What's that? The, the shock thing uh, for your back? Yeah, it's been doing okay. Last week I had a bad week. It mm -hmm. they hit me with a program that didn't work, and it kind of went backwards. So, uh, and the guy is sick, so oh, he couldn't reprogram me at the doctor the other day, but. Uh, most of the, most of it's working pretty good. We're just still tweaking with programs and stuff. You're kind yeah. of the bionic man, right? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Kevin, yeah. 
question. Can I ask him a question? Yeah, sure. Kevin, what about like a hot, I mean, it's not, what about a hot towel or a compress? Would that help your back? No, it's not my back at all. Oh, it's, it's not, not my not. back at all. It's my legs and my feet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because my foot, oh, my left ankle was operated on like 10 times now. Mm. You know, we have, and, we, and my heel yeah. is falling off of my foot. Well, if we have a cacophony, we have a, we have a cacophony of, of ailments here on yeah. the show. Mm -hmm. uh, it, Charlie, right. Charlie uh, is uh, he, he? You what? You lost uh, some toes, right? To diabetes, yeah. right? Yeah. Six of them. And how does it affect? How does that affect you? Uh, uh, exercising. Well, my balance is off. His math skills have been diminished. Your balance is off. <laughs> it's the oh. test. You know what was really strange? It's an automatic five. Uh, uh, um, um, what was really strange was that Sammy Davis Jr., when he lost his eye in the accident, mm -hmm. couldn't dance. Really? It threw wow. his balance off. Mm -hmm. And Sinatra had to teach him how sense. to get his balance back. But there was a while there where he couldn't, he, he literally couldn't, um, couldn't dance because of, mm. of, of losing an eye. You wouldn't think losing an eye would make you not be able to dance. Al, Alex, you were worried that losing a tooth might affect your, the sound of your voice. Or the way that I form words. And right. I think it kind of does, but only I feel it. But you see, what happens is when, uh, when, you're, when you're, and I've always been very careful about this, when you're when you're when you're talking, you you use your tongue against your palate and against your teeth, and so let's say if tomorrow I lost all my teeth and they put dentures in, my speaking would probably change as a result of that because of the way my tongue would hit the 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 dentures, as it were. Yeah. So I've always been very worried about that that losing your teeth could cause that. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 So, but then again, I worry about everything, don't I? <laughs> I, uh, I, I'm most, yeah. I, I just will not allow myself a moment of happiness, you know? Mm -hmm. I, just, I don't know if you can see that. What? An x ray of the spine. Oh, so those oh. are all the wires Ooh. in my back right now. Okay. Wow. Oh, wow. The, no, don't, nobody talks so we can see that. Those are the <laughs> wires in your spine. That's, that's those little dots right there, the nodes going up and down the spine that are shooting the uh, electricity to the nerves in my legs. Wow. And That's... that cluster of wires there goes to a little box that's in my, uh, basically my spare tire on the side. Wow. So wow. all those little things are the ones that are shooting and where is the, high frequency. Where, yeah, and where is the unit that it, it, in there that, where is... It's like right over here. Yeah, okay, yeah. But has it helped with the pain? Yeah, it's helped once we hit the right, you know, the right programs. It sounds like you're the bionic man and they have to program yeah, you. Like Steve Majors. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that's the device that's in this one over here is the one that's in my uh, side there. Yeah, the mm -hmm. Senzo 2. Ooh, it looks like a lock. Yeah. Uh, how, how do you change the channel? I got a little remote control. <laughs> Does it make I got to charge it every night. Yeah. I sit on a little iPad. Type charger like your iPhone charger, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wow. A wireless uh, charger. Yeah, wireless pad. So let me bring up one last thing here tonight that uh, was in the news, and I think it's worthy of a uh, of a discussion. And that is, did you hear about this guy who was, I think, caught trying to bomb something in New York City and went away for ten years? Oh, yeah, was, a mem was a member of like Al Qaeda and whatever, but he spilled the beans on Al Qaeda, and after ten years, they've let him just go, saying he's been a, a, an amazing well, amount I heard of help. That story, yeah. um, I know Phil probably thinks he shouldn't have gotten off, right? Uh, no, he's working for Ilian Omar now. Who? Uh, the uh, uh, Somali uh, woman that's a um, uh, a um, uh, congresswoman. Uh, the anti-Semite. Oh, Jesus, Phil. Well, you know, you always have to come back to these these touchstone talking points of Donald Trump. You don't have a mind of your own. Uh, okay. 
<laughs> oh, well, I'm glad you agree. Fine. Yeah. Fine. I, 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 you know, I agree with Donald Trump, but it, I, that was my own uh, observation, not Donald's. Hmm. That was his observation about no, what it was my, it was my observation. Well, it was your uh, observation. In other words, yeah. you're, you you can come up with the same idiotic ideas. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. That's that's yeah. why you know there's a, a commiseration there. There's there's okay. a, yeah. an understanding. Yes. So what does he think about cutting that guy loose? Uh, well, put him on the other side of the wall, I guess. Uh, you know, if the guy served his time and he's uh, and he's changed his position, uh, then that's that's what. That was a success, you know. Why? Uh, there's nothing wrong with cutting the guy loose. It's not a danger yeah. to society, and has, uh, you know, paid his debt. I'd like to get Scott's thought about this. Scott, do you have a thought? I, about I wasn't that? listening. I'm sorry. Oh, I, this this I was still muted. This was about this guy. I think you you may have heard about him, who uh, went to prison for uh, terrorism, and during his ten years in prison, he gave the our government a lot of information about al-Qaeda that was very important. And so they finally decided to let him go. They're not going to let him stay here. He's going to be oh. sent back to where... Well, I was going to say, I, I was hoping he'd be able to vote. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, he probably was voting anyway. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, but um, He voted for Trump. Yeah. <laughs> no, he was a Democrat. <laughs> but that was the other big piece of news. I'm trying to think. Was there know, any... They send him home. He's probably a dead man anyway. Is there, yeah. is there, is there any other news I missed today that we didn't uh, talk about? None that you'll believe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, none that we'll believe. Oh. Yeah. Um, um, it, I'm, I'm trying to think. There was, this, there was some other story, uh, and they were making a big deal out of it, but I, I can't remember. You know, well, I'll breaking news right now: a Boeing 737 slid off a runway into St. John's River right now. Oh boy, eye. that's in Canada, right? Montreal. Um, could it? It. I'm not sure because it just happened, and it's wow. Uh, you know, in the, Jacksonville, in Jacksonville, uh, Florida. Oh, St. really? St. John's River in Jacksonville. Wow. Uh, there, there's a thing going on with Zuckerberg uh, and and conservative websites or conservative. Oh, that that was the one I wanted to bring up, and now we're getting too late in the show. But that was something I wanted to bring up. Was the Got nine minutes? Uh, it was the um, uh, not nine minutes, actually less than that. But uh, alert the affiliates are going to go long. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> affiliates were going to go long. Uh, no, was was the banning of. Um, for instance, Louis Farrakhan, and who else was who else was in that list? Uh, I think Newsmax and a, and a couple of other, not yeah. Newsmax. Uh, what's the Alex uh, guy Alex in Jones? Infowars and Infowars, Info Wars. Info Wars, right? And yeah. then there was one other, and I can't remember who it was. Mm -hmm. And they said that they are not allowing them to have Facebook accounts because they're dangerous. Well, it's, they're talking about hate speech, I think. No, but they, the word they specifically used was dangerous. Yeah. But they, but they allow all of these uh, 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 sites to, uh, you know, Al Qaeda sites and ISIS uh, recruiting things and so forth. That's allowed, right? Uh, uh, That's not dangerous. Uh, well, no, but we don't, we don't understand what it is exactly that they have. Uh, that they have, uh, you know, they 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 ban, for instance, um, uh, what's his name, um, Farrakhan, who, quite frankly, I don't think is dangerous. All right. Do. Well, you do. I don't give a shit what you think. However, you know that that's been established. I uh, agree with Phil. Thank you. <laughs> what what you agree, Patrick? Go ahead. I agree with Phil. I think Farrakhan's a piece of shit. He's a fucking anti-Semite. I've yeah. written your talk. He's fucking racist as any white racist is. So yeah, he's an anti-Semite, Phil. Farrakhan's an anti-Semite. Okay. He hates all Jews. Okay, but let me ask you this question. Is that enough reason to call him dangerous? If they're going to call Alec Jones dangerous... You might as well call Farrakhan. I will dangerous. defend. I will defend oh. Alex Jones's right to put Infowars on on Facebook. I will that's, defend his right to do, uh, uh, First right Amendment to do that. issue. 
Mm-hmm. And I and I think that uh, Facebook uh, is is violating people's First Amendment uh, rights by. The First Amendment only covers the government. It doesn't cover private citizens. Yeah. Well, it's just that this is a monopoly now, The this Facebook. Yeah, There's but, three it, billion people that use you it. You know, if you consider that Facebook is kind of an electronic Hyde Park, as it were, uh, if it is that, then it shouldn't it have that same kind of democratic feel about it. That, yes, we don't like what Alex Jones has to say, and we don't like what Farrakhan says, but nevertheless, they have a right to say it, and 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 we can certainly look at it and go, this guy's full of shit. And make up the determination for ourselves. You can choose not to look at it as well. Well, that's true as well. Uh, you know, but what I'm saying is, uh, uh, shouldn't the public be the determination? The f- problem with Alex Jones is there's so many fucking people watching him, and you know, in spite they can take him off Facebook, but that isn't going to kill his audience. He, he, well, he's got his own website you can go to. Just well, like Farrakhan, there's enough idiots that follow that guy. It's the same thing. I mean, start, but the, I, I think I, that's... Ignore yeah. Ignore the sites, right? Um, but it is a private, it is a private uh, business. So, I mean... Uh, that's That's okay. kind of the difference. I think because Facebook is a private business, they have their rules. The internet is the wild west. Right. So yeah. let them do it on the internet, and then let the let the Facebook be the private business and have their rules. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I agree with Kevin because yeah. Farrakhan well, and Info yeah. War, they can have their own website. Yeah. They do. Ye- years ago, I I interviewed Farrakhan, and and he knew I was a Jew, by the way. And in the interview, I didn't even have to ask him about that. He said, no, I'm not anti-Semitic. In fact, he said I was a violin prodigy, which he was. And my biggest hero was Yasha Heifetz, who was a Jew. And at least at the time, I found him to be rather understanding in that way and misunderstood by the public in general because of the generalizations that have been made about him. But now, I've heard speeches of Farrakhan's that were inflammatory. Well, I think Jews. he's gotten more inflammatory as the years have gone on. But yeah. I have to say that I still will defend his right, you know, to be to say what he feels. I mean, uh, I, I as a Jew will be bothered by it and so on. But I don't feel that I as a Jew should shut him up. Let me put it that way. So I don't know how you. You guys feel about all of that, but uh, hate speech, hate speech. Well, it is hate speech. There's no question about it. But uh, and but on a platform like Facebook, it probably should be if that's what their rules are. If they're going to do it on the internet, go for it. That's kind of the way I think about. It. I was thinking about it because we talked about this before, and yeah, at one point I was thinking they should let them, you know, Infowars and all that, cut them loose on Facebook. But then you think about it, they're a private business. Let them make their rules. You don't follow the rules, then just go do it on the internet because the internet's, a, you know, it's a free space there. Go for it. Yeah. Because there's no rules there. Well, I mean, you know, that's uh, the way I look at yeah. it. Yeah. And then you can then you can scroll by and you don't have to go there. If you're on Facebook and that's going on, you got a lot of people that are just going to sit there and they're going to stop and they're going to look and they're going to follow. Well, Alex Jones is still going to be on the internet. No yeah, ma- you know, and that, that's, no, no, that's fine. No matter Whatever, what. I won't go there. Right. Unless I want to go there, you know, and see what's going on. Unless you want to go. If you're on Facebook, you can be scrolling by, and you'll see that, yeah. and you might stop, yeah. you might not. Yeah. So, you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, anyway, hey, listen, guess what? It's that over. Time. It, it's that time. I just had to go over sure and, is. and turn that off. Hey, listen, this has been nice. We it, it was a little trouble getting people on, and hopefully next week uh, Skype will have this little problem of theirs solved. But we have a work we have a workaround, and we that's how we were able to get all the people on. And Charlie even was a beneficiary of it because you saw me calling you, right? Yeah. So you were able to you were able to log on. So I can always call people back and make up a citizen panel too. But hopefully they'll fix that that little problem up. But, you know, this new machine of mine, brand new machine of mine, has been it's just... It's cooking. I, I am still, with all that's going on here, 
at uh, 10% CPU usage. It's, it's amazing. Anyway, that's it for tonight, folks. That's our citizen panels. You can see them there. There's Phil, and there's uh, Charlene, and there is... Uh, 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 um, <laughs> uh, the hog driver. Uh, let me see here. Uh, also Tony. Also Jeff. Also Rob. Also Patrick, whose name I couldn't remember last night. Scott and Charlie uh, and Kevin. Okay, that's it. That's our citizen panel. And if they'll all wave goodbye, I will wave back at them. Okay, there they go. Okay. All right, that's them. Let me hang up on them so that I can uh, uh, leave the Skype lines available for Jack Bishop, who is next over most of this same station uh, with the intersection. We're off for a couple of days, and then we'll be back uh, Tuesday night. We'll start off at uh, 9.30 with Damian Chaplin, and then at 10 o'clock at night, once again, it shall be me. Uh, same time, same station in life with the ramble. And in the meantime, as always, if you see her, please tell her I love her, okay? She doesn't believe it, but it's true.